It's always going to be this size. Go and, ooh, it just kind of like goes in order where they all stack out. So I'm like, oh, this is the one I need. So if you lose your wallet, you can pinpoint to where your wallet's going to be, but I can ring it. Or if you lose your phone on a couch or somewhere at the store and you can press this and it'll ring your phone. Okay, this is the N way. Translates to the innovative way. So let's take a look. So what we get inside is the manual. The USB charging clip. This is a unique wallet for those people who are tired of the normal conventional ones and you're also that person who loves to hang on to every single card that you have. This is going to be for you. And there is some hard materials built in here. So we have a magnet right away. It goes back to always wanting to close up. But we keep opening it up and unfold. So what this little flap is, just kind of hold things into place so it doesn't fall out from under. And it's easy to move out of the place. So you can grab things. So just fold it up and get things out of it. You can see right in the middle, those are little two pins that you will be using to charge. But you can see that this is a little slot to push out all your cards that you will keep in here. So what's the point for plugging this in to charge? The cord is not that long, so you're gonna have to bring like a little power bank or have it sitting up on your wall charger somehow. So we'll plug this in. And you can hear that beeping going on. And now it wants us to go on the website. It wants us to go to nwaytech.com slash app. And obviously it's available for Android and iPhone. And it wants us to use Bluetooth because that's how it's going to connect. Allow Nway to access your location. Send you notifications so if you ever lose your wallet, it knows how to notify you. And we're going to use those guests for now. If you don't make an account, you can only use this phone to track it. But if you lose your phone and wallet, you can't track it. So you want to make an account so you can log into another one. But we're just going to practice for now. Add an Nway. Select device type. Now here, this little section will double up as a power button. So let's click on that. Press and hold, and we can hear, this is the Nway accent. You press confirm, we'll tell you last seen with how close it is and the battery percentage. So this is going to contain all your important stuff, and we're going to leave it there. And let's say that I left it behind, and I don't know where I left it, but I can ring it. So we can see that it's ringing, and the light indicator there, and if I tap on it. So if you lose your wallet, you could pinpoint to where your wallet's going to be, or if you lose your phone, then you could... You know, have your phone off and you lost your phone in a couch or somewhere at the store and you can press this and it'll ring your phone. And you can see that it's actually flashing so that if it's in a dark area, you can look for it. That's how this app is going to work. To pair the app, wallet, and phone together, very simple to use. If you go into the settings, you can change the name of it. Separation alert. So if you do get farther away from your wallet, when your phone goes a certain distance or it disconnects, you go, hey, you're leaving your wallet behind. You don't want to do that, right? So you want to turn that on. There's the alert tone. So you can change it so you don't have to hear that one. If we go into ring it. Second alert. And let's press it. The phone alert, so if you don't want to hear that one that we heard, let's go to two, let's press confirm, let's send the, our phone. Send the wallet into. So those are some sounds there, you only get three. What does this do? We'd like to access your camera. So we'll allow it for now, and it has its own camera app. Other than not knowing what the camera app is for, let me see, find your phone. I don't really see anything telling you why it needs to be there. It might be just a shortcut. Let me go grab something real quick. Okay, so I got credit cards, my ID cards, my concealeds, everything like that in here. And how many cards is that actually? Let me count, don't look at my stuff. Oh, can't forget my Tesla card. So that makes seven. So I'm gonna be putting seven cards right in here. And it is going in pretty tight actually, if you see there. If I press down, it's just kind of staying where it was at last. And it's like almost like a smooth pull out. Like I can feel that it's going in there pretty tight. So let's go all the way down. Okay, so they seem to be firmly in there. Oh, shoots it out like crazy. It's always gonna be this size unless you have a couple of thick receipts in here that you can place. Like my business cards, I can just set that right there. And obviously it keeps it from falling down once you open it that way and it just clenches it when you do that. 
but the whole point is to never lose your wallet with your important credit cards because you don't want to file for losses and redo everything and change your credit card numbers and all your accounts. That's a hassle. I've done it twice in my lifetime with our lost stuff, but this way at least you'll protect yourself from having to lose your stuff. But let's hit it here. I'm talking too much and let's go and ooh, you can see that it props them all up the way it props it up all the way up so it does shoot them out um but they don't like fly out of it just kind of like goes in order where they all stack out so i'm like oh this is the one i need so that was a pretty good demonstration there where i just hit it and bust out my tesla card or get to the next one i don't want to expose any of my important stuff but you get the idea just quickly do that what happens if you just have one card let's put that in there and up so yeah there we go and of course we lose the wallet or the phone <laughs> my phone's going off don't lose your phone don't lose your wallet you got this option if you would like it for yourself you already know what to do find it in the description down below and as always thank you for watching and i will see you guys next time later